Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. Today I am going to do a updated skincare routine for you. This is something that a couple of people have asked me to film now. Um, if you've seen my skincare routines before then I do still use some of the same products but I also have some new ones so just to let you know it's not going to be exactly the same as what it was before. So I was a bit naughty last night and I slept with my makeup on so hence this right now. Um, so I'm going to show you how I take my makeup off and then the skincare that I use and the products that I use as well so let's do it. I'm just going to pop I got a little simple set for Christmas and it just comes with this little headband so as you can see it's covered in makeup because um, it's useful to use when you do your makeup but also skincare so right I'm going to start with running some hot water Okay, so the first product that I'm going to use is this little thing called a face halo. Now these come in a lot of different varieties. You can get cloths, you can get little pads like this. Um, my brother bought me these for Christmas last year, I think, um, and they are really, really good. It is one of those things that you just apply water and it takes your makeup off for you. I, this is a clean one and they're amazing because they're reusable, you can use them over and over again. Once they get covered in makeup you just throw them in the wash with all your other stuff and they come out bright white again. Um, it's really nice to get the white ones because you can see the makeup that you take off and it's quite gross. So that's what I use. It's also really good to just keep in the shower. I find, a little top tip for everyone. I find that if I take my skincare into the shower, or leave it in the shower, so this, these came in a pack of three, so I keep one in the upstairs bathroom, I keep one in the shower room, so when I'm in the shower, if I have makeup on, I can just take it off while I'm in the shower, and also um, cleanse my face and stuff while I'm in the shower, because it means that you actually do it, and you don't really have to dedicate time to do it, you just do it while you're in the shower. So first up, I'm going to use this, um, I'm just going to use some warm water and wipe my makeup off. There we go, already we have foundation all over it. I find it useful when taking your mascara off to hold the pad over your eye and just kind of like circle it a little bit before you start rubbing because that just loosens up the mascara um, and allows you to rub it off a lot easier. So there we go. That is the state of it when I'm finished. <laughs> so that's that, that's my makeup removed. I am now going to cleanse my face. So I've used this for a couple of years now. This is the Liz Earl Hot Cloth Cleanser. It is so good and I absolutely love it. So yeah, it's really easy to use. You just dampen your face, use a tiny, literally pea size amount rub it between your hands and put it on, so that's what I'm going to do now. Also, if you get the set, the hot cloth cleanser does come with the cloth as well. So you just rub it in, rub it all down your neck. The first time you buy it, it actually tells you like the motions to use. There we go, and then you just wipe it off. OK, 
Okay, so there we go. I'm all cleansed. It's so soft, it honestly feels so good. And then I just dry my face. And then when I moisturise, I tend to switch between three moisturisers. So I'm going to show you each one that I use. So the first one is the Simple Light Moisturiser. Like I said, I've got a simple set for Christmas because I have quite sensitive skin. So all of these products are products that work for me and don't irritate my skin. So that's the first one that I use. That's one that I use daily. Um, and then I also have this Olay Night Cream. This is really, really nice. It's really thick. Um, and it smells amazing. So I use that, like it says, at night time usually. And then the final one that I have is the Drops of Youth Youth Cream, um, which I'm gonna use now before the camera dies. And then I just apply some lip balm. I live, live with lip balm in my pocket. And that is that. If you have any questions, then please let me know. I hope you enjoyed this little video. If you've got any recommendations for me to film, then just stick them in the comments below and I will film them. Thanks for watching and I will see you soon.